In this video, I'm going to show you how to use a trading bot to automatically buy and sell Solana meme coins for profit. As you can see, the last 24 hours for me has been pretty profitable. In my sleep, I let this bot run in the background and it brought dips and it sold tops. So it's really, really good. Some of them I've, I've pulled out some good profits, but we'll go ahead and introduce Auto Snipe. The link to it is in the description if you want to check it out. But I'll show you what to do step by step. We're going to set up the AI Sniper. We're going to also show you the copy trade feature. So this is going to be a deep dive into the platform. This is probably the most profitable bot you could be using when trading Solana meme coins. The reason being it automatically does it for you. And it has an anti meme so there's no front run bots. And it has an anti rug feature with the third one, the third point to it, or the third bonus is they pick the best gas price for you. So it's also the cheapest trading tool to actually be using. So very simply go over and deposit some Solana. So connect your wallet, deposit some Solana, and you can do so like that. And then it will go into your balance whenever. So what we've got now is the AI sniper. We can also check out tokens on pump fund, top pairs, radium pairs, etc. You can go through and you can just buy with one click, which is what I really like. So now we've got the trading sniper bot. So this uses AI. And as you can see, I'm trying to work out which one works best for me. So this, this campaign, think of them as all campaigns. This is their default one. There's a few others. I've created some, some have brought me a lot of profit and I'm just trying to see which one it is. So when you want to create a sniper, so just think of these as campaigns, you want to find a campaign that brings you the most profits consistently and then keep that running in the background. So what we're going to do is we're going to make three campaigns or we'll make two. So we can call one safe and this one is going to be a safe one. So I want tokens only with I don't know, 25 Solana in liquidity. And I want them to be, we can go with new pairs. And I want it to be a rank, let's say 250, top 250 token on Solana. I want the LP to be burnt or at least 99%. And I don't want the top 10 holding more than 25% or 20% actually, because we're trying to do a safe one. We want, you can have this defaulted. I never would recommend to use these. So don't ever have these off. You can obviously have that off as well, but the socials part, it doesn't make too much difference. But I'm gonna leave, leave them checked, yes. Now what this has done, it's made a campaign. So we've done quite a safe one. It's not gonna buy too many. If there's dips, it will buy in and it genuinely buys the dips it's brought me tokens on that have been early ctos so someone starts buying and then it brought so it's really really good so this is my trading amount so this is what it will buy per transaction so i want it to buy 0 0.01 but i want it to only buy a maximum of five let's say for example the important part is the stop loss you put it too low you exit the trade with very little or no profits. So I want to have stop loss at 20%. You can play with this to see what works well for you. Again, you can select your fee. I would recommend their AI optimized one. Again, it will find the best transaction. So your transaction won't fail or it will find you the cheapest one. It is really good. And we want to sell, let's say we want to sell 50% of our bag at 50% profit and we're going to sell the remaining 50% at 100% and we can activate now that has made our sniper for us and it's currently activated now I want to make another one which is a risky play so I tend to call it risky and we're going to have 10 Solana which is about $1,000. And we can put the top 10,000 tokens. So we're pretty much aping anything and everything. Remember, this is an automatic bot. It will buy and sell for you in the background. So I want it to not have socials. Let's go with that. And we want to again be buying a very small amount. And we want to stop loss at 50%. So we're willing to take even more risk and we want to sell a whole bag 50% profit. Now, again, this is running now in the background. 
and let's do a crazy one so we can call this crazy so this one is not performing very well for me when I do these type of ones I want one minimum LP and I'm, we'll just do it's gonna buy everything basically uh, but we want the freeze and mint and we want the LP burnt as well so let's go with the dev can have a big amount of supply so hopefully that will get us in there again and we want a stop loss at 99 percent and we want to take profits at 25 percent so we literally want to get in and out very quickly with that if it runs more it usually just lets it run also we can have a look and we can hide our tokens that are sold so it's brought one and you can obviously click through and see but we're going to let it load up so it's brought three more so we can check these out so this one it's brought for us this must have just literally gone on to pump fun let's open up deck screener and see what it's purchased us so typically like I said it buys dips on tokens so this is doing okay actually So it's a pump fund token, it guess. Seems to be doing okay, good volume. Let's have a look. So bear in mind, it's brought some others and you can take a look. Let's check Husky. Husky seems to be doing okay. Let's check the one minute chart. So that one's gone up. Let's check this Husky one. So this Husky one seems to be a dip, a CTO that it's brought for us. And again, we're up 11% on that. So you can, depending on how much you buy, you can sell it, you can, you know, purchase it, you can buy more even. So it gives you a good indication. Bear in mind, we've aped a very small amount into these. So we're going to let these run and see what sort of comes of it so this one seems to be doing the best out of it that one's sort of falling off but this husky one might have been the start of a cto a community takeover someone's run ads on it which is good and it's doing okay so that might give us 100 percent profit again it's it's sort of running up nicely with that so we're going to show you the copy trade feature now and we're going to randomly copy let's say the top trader on the husky token so we can go ahead and grab this is just for demonstration purposes we can grab a wallet and what you want to do this will copy trade basically anything that that wallet buys so if you can find profitable ones my bad that's a bot let's, let's go with this one So let's put this wallet in so that was a contract that's why it didn't work and when it happens to you you know why so you've got two choices here you can either buy the exact amount they buy which i wouldn't advise or you can buy in a percentage with that so you can do a minimum order so let's say i want to buy that amount and i want to put in 0 0.02 onto that so now what that's going to do is it's going to copy trade every buy that person does whether or not again this is all trial and error see which wallets are profitable there are bots that you can try and find let's see how this husky is doing not too bad you can buy you can use bots to find or you can manually find i would typically go through and try and find insider wallets manually this is one of the easiest ways so you can find a big token on here and you can see top traders which one was the insider wallet which one done well make sure there's a buy so this one done pretty well you know 5x put $500 sold 2000 you can take this wallet and we can copy trade him as well the more you put in the better because some of these wallets won't get activated so I would suggest put very small amounts in and then afterwards you can up it so I want to again I want to put in I only want to do a few buyers with this guy let's do I want to buy the exact amount per order 
and we've set up our copy trade in now. So when we go back to this setting, we can see when these copy the trades, bear in mind if he's catching, if he's a wallet that is even 51% more profitable than he is losing, you will make profit from this. Yeah. So this is a good way to go on every day, find profitable wallets. Again, we can go into another token. You can take out, let's try, find a good one on here. That's probably a me bot, 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 bot. Let's go with this one again. And he's still holding, so that's a good indication that he's trading well. And let's just copy trade this guy again. Let's go, let's put a bit more for this gent. And again, so we've got three guys now that we're copy trading. So fingers crossed that any of them go in. Like I said before, they only have to be more profitable than losses and you'll make profit. If you find that this guy is not performing well, deactivate him. Just click deactivate. You can also view their trades. And that's how the best way to copy trade. Put a load up, invest some money, find the profitable wallets. I would say copy trading is probably the most profitable out of all types of trading if you can get it right now be aware once people work out they're being copy traded you have to monitor it well this is why on this platform it has a maximum you can amount so you allocate a certain amount otherwise if someone realizes they're being copy traded they can buy any token and then just sell it straight away and just take your money so it's not a good indication anyway let's go back to our sniper bot and we can see Again, once this max out, you can decide whether you want to make it more profitable. Example, you might just want to put, let's invest a bit more. Save it and your, your bot will be activated once again. So our bot's back on now. So this one isn't performing well. It's called safe. You need a few trades to let it run. You need to keep the bot running. So depending on how it does, you can see from there. This one I saw earlier, so I want to check it out from there. So again, I've just given you a demonstration of the platform itself rather than me finding the best ways to actually use the bot or God. Maybe I can just look through the platform itself. So the market cap's pretty low, but you know you're going to let these tokens run it must buy multiple of tokens and it's very exciting when you see one because these small losses are fine for me actually they don't matter the bot will automatically realize that this is not profitable there's no volume on it and it will sell it don't forget some of these have a 10 percent stop loss and a 20 percent or 40 percent take profit as well so they're not going to run in the background so my balance is 0 0.08 so I done this the other day and that was the profits I made when I showed you the the start of the video. I probably put in a 0 0.12, something like that, very low. And then I pulled out 0 0.4 in the morning. So it's profitable in a sense that just having it run in the background, finding your campaigns. Remember at the start of the video, I said call these campaigns. See which one performs well, deactivate it, deactivate it if it's not performing well. Some of them won't go through for various reasons it can't find anything everything's got locked their lps unlocked so it genuinely is a good tool to be using when you're actually buying solana meme coins or you're just looking for it to monitor dips you can either use it two ways to buy dips or to actually find tokens for you and then you can decide if you want to buy more it's overall a very versatile tool I would advise using auto snipe if you are trading Solana meme coins. All the best and take care.